In poop knife news, submitted oh. by Julia Chow. Oh, oh me? Oh. What? Oh. Because she chows. No, that doesn't make sense. Oh. I was gonna say chop. I was gonna say chop, chow, chow down, but that doesn't. That doesn't make I was like chow down on poop. Not chow down on poop. Not, 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 chow down on not on feces. Yeah, no. Not on poop. Well, if you look on Ant's uh, YouTube channel, <laughs> I don't know where I was going with that one. Oh. All right. Wait, what? <laughs> 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 I want to know what your train of thought was. Talking about the popsicle challenge? Yep. Oh, oh okay, that makes sense now. Yeah, all right. Because I, I saw, I was like, wait, why do I have an image of Julie eating a chocolate popsicle that had like nuts in it? Was that a th was it a chocolate popsicle? No, it was it was like those fruit popsicles. Oh, okay. Well, anyway. <laughs> well, knives made of frozen feces don't make the cut, disproving well-known legend. Yeah. Wait, wait so knives, knives made of frozen feces. feces. That's why I was thinking, because knives chow, that's what the joke was. I knives oh, chow wait, from Scott Pilgrim. That's, that's why I put those, that's why I was, oh, okay. but I messed up and I what screwed up on the way. <laughs> yeah. You what nerd. You tried. It's a different way to I spell tried. <laughs> But yeah, so uh, apparently there is a kind of urban legend that an elderly Inuit man in the 1950s um, fashioned a knife out of his own frozen feces and vanished into the Arctic. I guess, according to the story, his family took away all of his tools to try and get him to come out of the you know frozen wilderness and like be civilized in like normal society with everyone. And instead, he uh, made a knife out of his own feces and made it like freeze by spitting on it, and then he. According to this article, wow. um, killed a dog and then used the uh, like f the hide of the dog and the bones to like fashion a harness for other dogs and then he like to like do a dog sled thing and then disappeared off into the Arctic wilderness. What the fuck? So that's, <laughs> that's the legend. So then at Kent State University, uh, there's an anthropologist anthropologist named Wade Davis, and so he was like, oh, you know, what? I'm gonna test that out. So he made a he made a poop knife. <laughs> So science. See, this is my poop knife. If you can oh, even do it. <laughs> so that, that is the, that is wait, the poop wait, knife. I can't. What the fuck? That is the poop knife. Can you up the brightness? Sorry. Hmm. Up it. Oh, this one. You. Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. Man. PC person. Yeah. Wow. So that's that's the poop knife. So he made a poop knife, and uh, spoiler alert, it didn't work. <laughs> so, so he. <laughs> yeah, I would imagine it being crumbly and whatnot. So it was. I don't know if you call it crumbly, but it specifically said that. Um, it crumbled. Diet, uh, yogurt lentils. He said that it melted upon contact, and it just left streaks. <laughs> <laughs> on the hide that he was trying to cut, and mm. it just, uh, that's why Maybe I that's how he killed the dog. Yeah, you know what? Oh, but I feel like it, o it would probably only work when it's in really cold weather. Yeah, I'm calling BS on this guy because like the conditions aren't set. We don't yeah. know if his nutrition was right. We don't know. That's right. We don't know if his. <laughs> that's another thing that they brought up. They brought up um, that it was oh, a different. No. That it could have been a different. Um, a poop, nutrition. Poop yeah. Makeup. It was tougher than I thought. Having that much protein with so many fatty acids exclusive. Uh, <laughs> yep. Too many variables. Right. Exactly. The weather well, wasn't eat? right. That would help that solidify right. your yep. fecal matter. Did he have mm -hmm. a fibrous intake of things? Exactly. All right? Was he eating fur? Because I know when my dog eats a lot of fur. Hers oh, comes out of his poop. Wait, wait, so, wait, why is he eating fur? Well, I, I don't know. He does weird things, but He's it's, old. it's kind yeah. of adorable. <laughs> they did say that it was able to cut the subcutaneous fat okay. on the underside of the hide, but the knife edge still melted quickly and became unusable. But but did he do it in cold weather? Um, I don't start know. that way. Oh, yeah. cu cutting had been uh, done in a room with a temperature about 10 degrees Celsius okay. and 50 degrees Fahrenheit, and therefore. Future experience might examine colder context. Yeah, that, I was that, like, yeah, that, yeah. That, that's not cold. That's not cold yeah. enough. Yeah, exactly. Like that's not cold then you get like Canadian cold or something like that. I, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know when the exact like time period of the original story took place or when how cold that was. Well, but to it's be. anyway. It would be yeah. But wouldn't Canada, you, Alaska, wouldn't you imagine yeah. that if you were holding in your hand though that that would warm it up anyway and start to melt in your hand? True. Depends on how many insulation yeah, layers you got. Like, I guess so. Right? <laughs> oh yeah, you're right. If you can't feel your hand, there's no heat coming out. Of it. Exactly. He lives out already in the snow. His temperatures are probably way less than everybody else. Mm. And then on top of that too, how do we know he only used one knife? All right, what if he was fastening a bunch of them? He had an entire, like, jacket. Dude, he's got, like, a oh, Batman knife. utility belt of poop knives. So, yeah. he, so he was, like, oh stocking up a poop knife. Exactly, like, yeah. yo, I'm picturing this dude's, like, legitimately in the forest, and he's just, like, straight up Naruto running through stuff. He sees it, pulls out a dagger, like, throws it at another one. He's mm. he's dropping stuff. He's, he's got like, shuriken of poop bro. knives. Yeah, exactly. And then, like, at the end, he does, like, a quick, like, seal, smashes <laughs> seven knives together. He's a super knife, and that's what he uses to skin He's so it. fucking oh, weeby. <laughs> no, you wouldn't use a sword, Ryan. Because, because then that just makes leverage too hard, all right? You gotta have like the blade probably around like. You know, I'm I'm kind of thinking like, what if the poop 
is just a texture and design for the knife because I feel like you can make an ice blade. Yeah, yeah. but I, I, I don't know yeah. if you, how many things you can cut with an ice knife because I think people have tried that before. Because isn't there that you can't really get it. there's that urban shatter? legend of like of like um uh, like an assassin making an ice pick mm -hmm. like with with mm -hmm. ice and then stabbing someone and then yeah. breaking it off and then leaving and then they and bleed then, out and, and then you it can't melts. tell who. Yeah, so very nice. nice. The thing about blades though is okay. blades is all about technique because you can take a sharp point, push it on something, but then it just pushes the skin down. But if you do it at a slicing angle while applying certain like angles at mm. it, that's how you yeah, actually get a cut. Yeah. But I don't know that the the edge like stays consistent enough because like that's why metal makes such good knives is because yeah. that like little micro serrated edge that is along the edge of the blade I, like I stays have a solution you know, to this. together. Our next JK party video, we're gonna make poop knives. Oh, oh my god. Hey, the poop knife <laughs> challenge. Might be a solo, a solo endeavor for stuff you. Back. There you go. <laughs> the challenge, you gotta make a poop knife and then you gotta stab someone with it and break the skin. Okay. Uh, it yeah. sounds like you two should lead <laughs> yeah. that. Uh, Let's do it, Sean. Poop knife yeah. fight to the death. <laughs> what, are our, what are our team names? Uh, Put them in the comments down below. <laughs> like, comment, subscribe. Buy the Kishi on Amazon. <laughs> the, by out there, Antoine Bandelay. This does have historical context, though. Not in that you, you should be able to knives. actually, yeah, you <laughs> make poop knives. But um, back in ancient times, when people, you know, were fighting with swords and mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. arrows stuff mm -hmm. like that, mm -hmm. they would put no, they would literally put fecal matter right. on so it so that when you get hit with it and you pull it out, you're still going to get fucking infected and yeah. you die afterwards. Uh, so <laughs> yes, you do want to use that for that context, I but only when you. Want to kill somebody? <laughs> Not when you're trying to survive in the wilderness. Yeah. Like, what the I'm just imagining like the entire army just shitting in a bucket, and then yeah, everyone, they, everybody, dip it in. Yeah. They, they take their quivers and they just dip it in. <laughs> just like the dudes are like, I hate this part of the day. <laughs> it's the worst part of the day. And someone's like, we should probably use fire, people. Let's mm. use fire instead. Uh, <laughs> they like, they like look at him. What is your they job? Just ignore is just him. A, him. Just imagine your job is the the knife pooper, uh, the blade man. pooper. Like, like there's a blacksmith. And then there's like <laughs> right next smith. to the blacksmith <laughs> is the poop smith. I wouldn't mind. You're probably being fed really well to have the poop. Or fed really terribly. Like right. yeah, I feel like you'd be fed Shitty. very terribly. After prisoners of war, you just stuff with like mm -hmm. grass or something. Like Taco Bell. <laughs> Taco Bell. <laughs> <laughs> Like, we need you to fill up these buckets with poop. Go to the local Taco Bell. Yeah. Paul's got dysentery. Grab the bucket. Oh, <laughs> grab it now. Go, 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 go. go. <laughs> Arrows, hurry. We strike at dawn. <laughs> yeah, get that in there too. Get his vomit. Put it in there. <laughs> both sides. Both sides. <laughs> South Park. I'm Dip good. it in there. <laughs> oh, we gonna stab him real good today. I'm surprised Game of Thrones has it, have put that in one of those things, like, because they get pretty gross. You would think yeah. they would have that in context for, like, the realistic. I think it's a little warfare. too weird, though. It might be too weird. It might be too weird. weird. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> incest was fine. But... Incest was fine, but poop jokes, no, no, not at all. You know what? They didn't have time between writing all the lore about the different incestuous children and <laughs> what happens with them. I mean, if they expanded season six, they probably could have put in poop, poop jokes in there. There you go. So we got denied poop knives, which, you know what? That actually probably could have stopped the walkers before they even got dragon. What if that's what dragon glass really was. Oh, Made out dragon nice. poop? Yeah. And, and the dragons just that. hated that shit. Yeah, like what if like the dragons all literally just like crapped in one area uh, and it formed a mountain. Oh, and then oh. That makes sense because you know, because their their bodies are, I would think, warm because they breathe fire. So once you sling it in them, it just dissolves to shit, and then they fucking die. <laughs> and just like you said, you said when they stab the, the hides with the poop yeah. knives, it melted. What happens when you stab a walker with a dragon glass? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it's real. This guy was on his own. Oh my god, I like this. Are you gonna make a video about how why all the, all the walkers died? Oh my god, yes, I should be tied to this. Do. April, Fool's, uh, April, Fool, April Fool's April Fool's video. Oh April yes, Fool's, make yeah. it! April Fool's video. Yeah. Why Actually, why like, walkers I can see you I can see you delivering all of this with a completely serious, like straight, like nerd rage face and just be like, no, this is what happened. This like, is actually what happened. Why? Like they all died. Like I, I'm telling you, people. Like they, I don't know why anyone believes. Me. <laughs> <laughs> but like, but that was the other thing. Like medieval times, didn't they also do like the thing where they've like hucked cows, like <laughs> like rotting cows over over yeah, like, oh, to, yeah, yeah. to uh, medieval like, times, like the yeah. restaurant restaurant. Hucking, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. You know what's funny about that restaurant? Um, so when I was a kid at camp, when we went there, it's completely different from the adult version. So when you really? go there as a kid and like someone like like push you down and like starts to stab you, they're like, no, 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 no draw blood drawn in this. Tournament, and we're like, oh, really? like me as like knowing what the real one was. I was like, what? <laughs> no bloodshed.
bloodshed. And then when he went as an adult, it was like. Then it was like, yeah, bloodshed. Fucking kill that guy, you know? <laughs> Rip his head off, take his intestines out. Like, but not real, but Wait, you know. Did they say no bloodshed? Did they like look at the audience? <laughs> like break the fourth wall and be like, no bloodshed. <laughs> no bloodshed, <laughs> no bloodshed <laughs> kitties. Yeah. Like it's like, and if you like cheat or like knock somebody off the horse, they're like, no, you're disqualified. You're like, DQ'd? Uh, <laughs> That's the fucking point of the shit. Like, what are you guys talking about? Like, I thought that was always like the funniest shit. I came shit. here for some murder. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and kids violence. do worse shit. Like, they always think we're like super innocent as children. And actually, I'm doing that now too because I'm writing a YA novel and I'm yes. like, realizing I'm doing that same shit. I'm like, mm. can kids handle this? And I'm like, Antoine, shut the fuck up. Kids yeah. can handle anything right now. <laughs> Wait, a what novel? Young adult, young adult. Yeah. Oh, did I say YA? Yeah, you said YA. I'm sorry, I used, in, like... We understood, we, we except for me. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, young adult, young adult. Yeah. We pieced yeah. it together like a poop knife. I'm like, is it okay to have this blood? Yes, it's okay to have fucking blood. Like, yeah. shut the fuck up. Yeah, you can see blood. That's yeah. fine. Yeah. Mm. Ridiculous, yeah. ridiculous. I mean, yeah. dude, parents like bring their kids to, like, rated R movies. I hate that, Yo, though. I saw I so many kids at Joker. Joker. Yo, yeah. whoa, that's Stop, weird. Yeah. Stop yeah. fucking yeah. doing that with your kids. You ruin it for everybody else, and your kid, I can almost 100% guarantee, doesn't enjoy the movie. Yep. Because they're fucking they're the entire fucking movie like, what's going on? Oh my god, what? Is there there were some posts that were like, that were like, there, do not bring your kids here. There is no Batman. <laughs> I mean, even before, well, technically. I mean, okay. Mm, ah, spoiler, but this is way in the future. Yeah. Um, spoiler! You know, that's yeah. weird because even it, that, the fact that, you know, it gets bloody at the end, but even before that, like, I don't see how a kid would, like. It's very, uh, even as an adult, uh, it was a really uncomfortable yeah. movie. Yeah. Like, it's not a movie that I would take my kids to, like, I feel like there are fun rated R movies. Yeah, yeah, yeah there are. That's not really one of them. Like, I, I can, I can kind of maybe understand Deadpool, even though that's yeah, even bad, too. Say. But that's it's, so cartoonish and it's, it's almost violent. Like a joke. It's but that's right. also that's also why they released the PG thirteen Christmas version. Right, yeah. right, right. Yeah. Smart marketing. Yeah. Like even like I was say the Kill Bill scene, the the crazy eighty eight scene, like that was so yeah. cartoonishly like yeah. that's yeah. not how blood goofy, works. But, yeah, it's goofy. No, but it makes Joker's sweet. yeah. Sorry. Yeah, I was gonna say Joker's very like realistic, yeah, and gritty, and like it makes because the movie is built to make you feel gross and uncomfortable. Yeah, like, I, that's, what I, so that's, that's what I liked great. about it. That's what I liked about it. Yeah. Should we make a video about Joker? Mm -hmm. I, I can, I can talk about that shit. I, I, can I can. I can talk about that shit. Um. Yeah.